Estrogen is the primary female sex hormone that is responsible for reproductive and sexual development in women. It is present in small quantities in men, but it is the key ingredient that makes us biologically female. Estrogen plays a lot of roles in a woman's body. So not only does it help with developing secondary sex characteristics such as breast development, armpit hair, whiter hips, it also helps with bone metabolism, regulating cholesterol, brain health, and it even helps with regulating food intake and your metabolism overall. So when we have low estrogen, things can get a little wacky in our systems. When estrogen levels decline, your entire system can be thrown off by this hormonal change. And sometimes this is very normal. So for example, some women in the postpartum period, that is the period after childbirth, experience low estrogen. Again, it's very normal and their symptoms are actually quite similar to women in menopause. Menopause is another normal phase of a woman's life where estrogen levels fall. There are some other causes of low estrogen in women. Things such as extreme exercise habits, anorexia, PCOS, which is polycystic ovarian syndrome, and liver disease can also be causes of low estrogen. Symptoms of low estrogen include hot flashes, vaginal dryness, irregular or absent periods, breast soreness, difficulty concentrating, anxiety, depression, mood swings, fatigue, insomnia, lack of vaginal lubrication, an increased risk for urinary tract infections, infertility, headaches and migraines, and bone fracture. Bone fracture is really interesting and kind of unique in women because women are more susceptible to getting osteoporosis and having bone fractures than men. And this is because of estrogen. Estrogen, again, plays a key role in bone formation and bone metabolism. So how do we treat low estrogen? Low estrogen is treated based on the cause. So if you're in menopause, having low estrogen is a very normal phase of your life as a woman. A lot of women get hormone therapy, which can be really beneficial because it increases those estrogen levels enough to keep you com comfortable in perimenopause. If you have symptoms of low estrogen or you're just feeling hormonal, women are hormonal cyclical beings. It's wonderful, it's okay. Go see your doctor because he or she can make a number of recommendations that can help you treat the cause of low estrogen. Now, some women benefit from just treating the symptoms of low estrogen. So again, if you're in menopause or perimenopause and you have a symptom such as vaginal dryness, maybe you don't need HRT or hormone replacement therapy. Maybe instead you would benefit from a natural vaginal lubricant that can help make things a little more comfortable down there. Again, treating low estrogen is based on the cause and where you're at in life. And meeting with your doctor is a great first step into getting your low estrogen symptoms under control. Thank you for joining me today on the Perry Channel.